crunched the numbers, and those 63 football championship subdivision scholarships that NC Central has just don't add up to the 85 that East Carolina has in the higher level football bowl subdivision. But that's if you're doing the math on paper. First year NCCU coach Jerry Mack is working with that fuzzy math that will get solved between the numbers and hash marks on the football field at ECU's Dowdy Ficklin Stadium in Greenville on Saturday. And here's some more math. ECU has lost just one time to an FCS school. That was back in 1980 to Eastern Kentucky. The Pirates since then are 22-0 against FCS schools. ECU has played in bowl games seven of the last eight years, like the 2013 Beef O'Brady's Bowl at Tropicana Field in St. Petersburg, Florida, where senior running back Ventavious Cooper ran for 198 yards and two touchdowns to help the Pirates score 20 unanswered points in the fourth quarter in a 37-20 comeback win over Ohio. Now, Cooper's gone, but ECU quarterback Shane Carden and ECU wide receiver Justin Hardy both are back, and those two really love to play catch with each other. That duo has combined for 18 touchdown receptions during their time at ECU. Those catches for scores lead all active quarterback wide receiver tandems on the FBS level. In other words, preseason all Mid-Eastern Athletic Conference NCCU quarterback Mike Jones and his buddies in the defensive backfield will have to solve for X and figure out a way to slow down what the Pirates like to do through the air. Keeping you connected from the fields to the stands, I'm Herald Sun sports writer John McCann.